Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I just made a video on taking this colored clip art and making it black and white. And while it was loading, I started looking at it before I erased it and thinking the lady or the person, I don't, can't remember what they are, uh, might want the water around it. So you can just take the water, click on the water, your nudge factor is still set on the same, and just arrow it down and then left click and make it gray. And I'm going to show you why in just a second. So we're going to delete this. We're going to bring in our yellow box trick just to make sure there's nothing hidden. And everything's clear. Uh, you can see the yellow through the ripple. So you got black and you got gray. And the way I would engrave this, and you could color map this for sure. But depending where it is on your plaque, it doesn't really matter. What I would do, and I do this a lot, I would click on my water and move it off the screen by two clicks. I would group this together just in case it's not grouped and I would run this job at whatever speed and whatever power you think black should be and then I would take this and move it off the screen two clicks or one click depending on your nudge factor and just move it back two clicks. Now I would run this job without moving your board or your tile or whatever you're engraving on and run this at a lot faster, a lot lower speed, and it'll give it that look that I would think you would want of having that water just a lighter shade of this will be quite a bit darker and, and look like that, and it'll actually look kind of like what it is right now. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.